What's going on guys? My name is Emmett Enyart and in this video you'll get to experience the deer hunts from our late muzzleloader season. But before we get into the video, if you're a fan of deer hunting, turkey hunting, or shed hunting and doing it all on a working class schedule, then you came to the right channel because that's exactly what we do. So if you're interested in following along, make sure to smash the like button, punch the subscribe button, and hit the bell so you can be notified when we drop more videos. Enough from me, let's get into the video. Here we go, on the late muzzleloader season in Iowa. Since it had already been a great year, we didn't have high expectations for the late season, but that wasn't gonna stop us from hunting. With mild temps and no snow in late December, we decided to start off the late season by hunting over an alfalfa field that was centered between a late season food plot and a cut corn field. We had noticed on trail cam that a lot of deer were transitioning between these two food sources, and it was a hot travel route that time of year, so here we go, December 26th. Thank you. 
steps out. Just let him take another step or two. See if I'll get that in there. I want him to take another step. Undo that. Nice. Nice. Tag <sighs> down. What do you think? Pretty good deer. As that's uh, the second day of the sm late smoke bowl season and you're tagged out. Three bucks. What do you have to say after that? Good late season muzzle litter buck, huh? Absolutely. Second day out, you can't be a swim with that. Jeez. Two oh, bucks in one year. End up with Tex. A buck that was three miles from here. Two miles from here. Really nice awesome we're in the 2020 season, huh? Yep. Time to celebrate. So in the end, Emmy 
did not end up filling her late muzzleloader tag. Best part about the Chubby story is we ended up finding his match set later in January that year. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please make sure to smash the like button, punch the subscribe button, and hammer the bell so you can be notified when we release more videos. Also, feel free to check out some of our other videos that are shown here. The one in the bottom left is the video where we end up finding Chubby Sheds, and it was so funny because Yankee and Splits both dropped a shed within 40 yards. It was awesome. Make sure to watch that video. And if you want to watch another awesome deer hunting video, make sure to click the video that's in the top left. Thank you so much for watching, and please stay tuned for more.